Greetings everyone and welcome back to Victoria 2, the game in which we love playing in the 19th and 20th century right now. We're currently at war with Colombia because... Why not? Let's go to war with Colombia. We just beat one of their armies. If you look at that, I should have showed you in the battle, but they didn't have that many soldiers. So, and we're already sieging them down, but I really wanted to push time a little bit ahead because last episode we spent a long time together in Victoria 2, and I want to keep pushing us ahead more and more. And I do want to see what happens with, um, but a potential great war that could spawn in this episode. But we'll see what happens. Right now, you can see that we actually connect all the way from like Tangier all the way down to the Lower Congo. Also, we are trying to fight the Dutch for Gabon. Everyone, or not everyone, but like the Spanish, us, the French, and the Germans are all tr trying to kill each other for the Western Sahara. I love sand. Actually, I hate sand. Uh, well, let's we'll see what happens. Lindy, not bad. Tanjanika, which I should have realized, I should have got this place earlier, just because we wouldn't, we probably would have been able to connect all the way up to here, or even to Ethiopian lands up here. But you know, whatever. As long as we get over here, that's pretty good. Uh, regardless, we still got to kill all the Colombians, like I said. Vietnam's looking even ever smaller. Qing Empire still looking pretty good. What other wars are going on right now? Just ours. Cool. We have 24 divisions versus six. Nice. Uh, we've got a couple, quite a few comments to go through as well, though. But let's go ahead and do this war. Let's get time up. Let's see. Someone asked me, how much time do I spend? Oh, look. Reforms. How much time do I spend on save scumming? It really depends. Oh, here we go. Here's the next battle. But let's do the reform first. Uh, sometimes I save every... 15 days, sometimes it gets really bad where I just save every 10 days. Sometimes I save, I quit the game, reload the game, and then try to save scum again, which which is totally fine just because it doesn't take that long to reload the game, especially since, I've, since I have this on an SSD. We do have illegal child labor, finally got rid of child labor, you know. It's only, I guess, we had to. We just had to. Uh, let's see, there's a lot of support for socialism, conservatives, and liberals. Let's see, reactionary, anarcho-liberal. Communists. Let's see, what do we want? People really want low minimum wage. Nah. Uh, capital punishment is not bad. Militancy non-colonial. You get more suppression points, but I don't really care about that. Increase colonial migration. Increase the necessity of bureaucrats. Incarceration. No facts. Rehabilitation. Less suppression. But better assimilation rate and immigrant attraction. Or restricted rights. Primary culture can vote. Cultural rights. Even more assimilation. Okay, cool. And all the rights allowed. More assimilation, immigrant interaction, less militancy, all cultures can vote. I'm kind of pulling towards this. I like the more assimilation factor. And we can't get low healthcare yet just because we have to do or get... Well, I think we have to get germ theory for this. And I, do we have the technology yet? We might, we might not. Or that invention, really. Uh, nitroglycerin, continuous influential stuff. We might have that. Post-Napoleonic doctrine, of course, is nice. Uh, let's check it out. Medicine... Nope, we have it potentially unlocked, but there's a 2% chance, so. Uh, we're doing pretty darn well. Let's look at this. Oh, the Battle of Ibagu. So, we are not doing well on terrain or crossings. Hey, but we're still doing okay. Uh, let's see, he holds a hand drawn back at a low angle, as if genuinely surprised at the strength of the blow just delivered. The suspense is gone now, and he isn't angry anymore, only terrified. Gritting her teeth, she says, in the stuttering tone of pain in a foreign tongue, There's a special place in heck for Tukalor swine like you. Those who might those might be the only words our, of our language you'll ever learn. The next day, the incident known as the Guantanamo Bay school strike of 1891 is in full swing, as parents refuse to let their children set foot in the draconic system that is a Tukalor school. Verb form, sweetie. These are the keys to success. Reform the curricula. Discriminatory school systems. Do we like discrimination? Especially in education. Well, it depends. Do, do, this is Guantanamo Bay, right? Discriminatory school systems. Oh, maybe it's not just there. Let's see. Discriminatory school systems. We get more assimilation rate. We do get less research points, which I don't like. But I like assimilation. Even though we already hurt, we are hurt there, so I want to keep as much assimilation as possible. It, it, it is what it is, you know. Besides, if they wouldn't be spitting at us, they'd be spitting at the Spanish. Oh, look at that. I love Cuba. Look how Santiago de Cuba is. Look how multicultural it is. Look at that. Gur, Manda, Hausa. I love it. Cuba itself is getting some Qua, some some Hausa and Ebo. That's actually really cool. Spread, spread everywhere, everyone. Cool. Nice. We didn't lose that many guys. Oh, well, we actually lost more than the other group, but it doesn't really matter. As long as we win, because I do want to take this province of Kauka, so they have no no access to the sea. Oh, look at this. Invest in a colony. I think we will. We might lose it. Honestly, we might end up losing all this. 
But we'll see what happens. I really, 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 though, want a great war to happen. And that we're not involved so that people can get, become extremely weak. That's what I that's what I really want to see happen. Actually, you guys are going to come right there, too. Now, come to Manizals. Manizals. Ooh, excellent. Great. Tensions dissipate. That's good. And you guys can try to siege stuff down, but it won't matter. Oh! Okay. I don't remember getting that one, but okay, sure. We'll take that. Or, you know, we can get that Castus Bella. It doesn't really matter too much. Uh, other comments. Um, always go for liberals if you're not going to go to war soon. That's what someone said. That's not bad. Yeah, we like that. But if we are going to be at war, stick with the nationalists. Or royal faction, which we technically already are. Because I like state capitalism. We're only pro militancy, but that's okay. Yeah, liberal faction, that's, 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 yeah. It's not bad. But I have a feeling here that as soon as we, like, get rid of conservative support, because the royal faction is considered conservative, which is a 50%. That's going to start a snowball in which we'll just stay in liberals for a while, and then we'll probably eventually start staying for socialists the way HPM works, because once you go socialist, it's hard to turn back. Unless you have, like, a violent revolution. Which is cool and all. Sometimes we don't want a violent revolution. We want other people to have violent revolutions. At least for a while. So let's go ahead and see what we have here. Projects? Explosives? Sure, why not? Can I build any bigger factories here? And we're out of money. Cool. Come on, take the capital out. Can we piece you out yet? No, we are nowhere close, and I'm not going to uh, be too crazy and attack that area. And they siege that down, whatever. Doesn't matter to me. Go into archaeology. Uh, let's see. If you like reading about this, go right ahead. So, we've read about this before, actually. Just to display the baubles somewhere locally. Or the future. This will teach future gen generations about the common heritage of mankind. Aw, oh, yeah. More prestige. More better. More skull. Other things. People say we should lower poverty. Yeah, we should. We probably should. We're actually doing pretty well in uh, money. How, why are we doing so well? We're doing well here. We're doing well here. There. We're doing well there. Hmm. Oh, that's why. Now less money. But we're still making a good amount. That's actually a really good amount. Yeah, keep going, Jarrett. What the heck? The Manifesto de Monte Cristi. Jose Marti, a Cuban intellectual and radical, has spent a great deal of time organizing emigres in the U.S. His return to the colony declared the Manifesto de Monte Cristi, an exposition of the purposes and principles of the coming Cuban Revolution. It seems the uprising has been in the planning for some time, and if the Tucular intends to remain control of Cuba, it would have a battle, or could have a battle ahead of it. Well, revolutionary times, huh? I guess time to put down the Cubans. All right, you guys good? Let's go ahead and move on in. Ooh, nice. More naval base stuff. As someone did say in the comments, we should invest more in our naval bases, which we will. And I'm going to go ahead and grab another military thing here. We, someone also recommended we get military science. Um, I'm not seeing here. Maybe it's an invention. Telegraph, stuff like that. Military stuff. Systems, of course. Logistics. Oh, this is all military science. Yeah, definitely. Get, we're going to grab some more of this. It's only less than 5,000 cost, so. Oh, we're losing a lot of guys. We are losing so many guys. We're actually going to lose this battle. Wow. That is not good. Oh, we're out of fort. Oh, yeah, we lost. Wow, we lost a lot. Is this... Wait, hold, hold on. Oh, the phone. Bogota. Bogota. Is that a... That's just a grassland. Oh, we're losing the race down here. Let's go do that. Oh, we got even more score. Nice. Um, oh, yeah. We created a protectorate. Thank you. Build roads. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nothing better. What did we do down here yet? No... Good. Do that. Ooh, looking very nice. That's my bad. Maybe I will... Ooh, let's, well, well, I guess we can try to get this area, too. Nice. Ooh, what is this? The Saharan Frontier? Wait, we can do that again. Oh, we need to do this one, too. Yeah, we need investment banks, which is another comment that someone said we should get. The Trucial Treaty to be a peace. Mass politics. Ooh. Oh, we get him as a puppet. We learned our spirit. We get a thousand. Ooh, look at that. Oh, we'll read that one. We can do that, so let's keep... Keep that in mind. So here in Frontier. Nice. Oh, we just get it for free. That is... Oh, my gosh. I wish British Africa wasn't here. I'd trade you Eritrea. Eh, maybe not Eritrea. I'd trade you, like, the horn of this up for, for for the connection down there, but whatever. Not bad. Now, it's my fault I lost up here. That's completely my fault. I'm glad we got other ships, though. Let's, let's pull you guys around. There we go. Is there anywhere else we can invest? We can't invest there, which kind of sucks, but, um... I think we're running out of spots to invest in. Oh, how about down here? Oh, we're out of points, too, so... Makes sense. Actually, you guys... We have another boat. 
I might have made an oopsie with my boats. Actually, yeah, you guys just come down here then. Calabar. Uh, are we making any divisions? Benin. Yeah, we're still making them. Oh, yeah, we got to invest in our ports. Wow, that cost 60,000 points. 60,000 monies. Holy smokes. Well, that's alright. We lose one battle, we'll just come back and kill them again. They're not, they're not very much morale at all. Uh, you guys just kind of hang out first. You just get more... What you calls it? Morale. Morale. That was my fault. Hey, look, another reform. Not bad. All right. I don't want to do this because I don't want everyone to vote. But actually, oh man, 28%, 27%. I think conservatives will still probably stay with us, but oh, capital punishment, transportation. You know, that might be good to do actually too. And I do all rights allowed. Way more simulation. Way more simulation. Hey, look, we got more strength back. That's that's good. Oh, look at that. Venezuelan reactionaries. Oh, let's take a look, a look at this as well. Congo Free State. Hmm. Hmm. What type of RGOs do they have down there? Can we actually get their RGOs, maybe? I'm not sure if it's really worth fearing them. We still have these guys, too, and they really actually like us. They're not our puppet, but that's alright. Germany still kind of likes us. The UK kind of likes us. That's got to be sucky to live in Sudan right now. Oh, we still going to take out Kafa as well. You guys are still great power. What if we could grab Carlos Spain to be our puppet? Or, they're not even a secondary power. Ooh, but is it really worth sphering them? I'm not sure about that. French Algeria. Liberia. How about Brazil? Let's get Brazil under us. I think that'd be a good idea. Brazil's a nice nation. Can't quite puppet them, but that's alright. Better tax efficiency. A, insurance companies. I'm not sure if I really like insurance companies, but hey, that's okay. Before we let time go on, double check this too. It's so not doing too bad right there. Right now we have, oh, 100%, pretty good. Let's see, it's getting better over there. Let's see, not bad. Court simulation. We do only have less than 19 infamy, which I do want to save. So if we ever go to war, during a great war and we win, then we can get some more colonies, but that's going to cost like infamy. So I want to be careful with what we're doing. Just got to be careful. Um, then again, I said be careful, and then I'm spending all my money on, like, factories. Cool, we got him back. I don't think they can really make... get any more guys here. Well, I'm going to go back to the capital. It's taking a little longer than I liked, but whatever. I made a mistake earlier. I thought our soldiers could work with this. Incident in the Tukula Guatemala... Eh, if you want to read about that, go right ahead. We just, just, just casual terrorism in Guatemala. Oh, that's not good. Are we? Oh, we have no more colonial points. Oh man, I will go to war with you, Netherlands, if I have to later on. I will. Uh, not yet though. We can't do it before that. Hmm. Someone did say investment banks, so we'll do one more, and then I kind of might. We'll probably do more industrial stuff because people always recommend getting more industrial stuff, and that's good. It's good stuff to get, so. Oh, wow, we quickly conquered them. Nice. Come on down here. Six. Let's continue raising relations with these guys. Ah, oh, you're on the British sphere. Good. Wood production output plus 15%. Fourth in the row in terms of prestige. Not bad, I would say. Alright, at this point, could we actually just kill these guys off? Let's try. They have 11,000 soldiers. I can't imagine them sticking, standing up for this. Oh, no, you don't. No, you're not going in there. Don't make me do this, Columbia. I know attacking in the mountains is really bad. We've lost once, and I'll lose again if I have to. Oh, there they go. They don't want to die? Good choice. Good choice, guys. Good choice. All right, let's go ahead and lower this a little bit more. We oh, we took a loan out, I guess. We there you go. We low tariffs, very low tariffs. And a hey. wait, we're, we're losing another race. Is it over here? Ah, oh, it is. You know this could, this could potentially spark a, uh, a uh, another war between everyone. So we'll see what happens. 
Now that's not bad. Took over Colombia. I also like took over Colombia. Or Cuba, I should say. Cuba. Cuba. As some call it. So you guys, you guys stay over there. And then... Oh man, we're definitely going to need to boost you guys up. You have one, two, three. So we need one more and then one more. One, one. Well, we can take that one off from there. And one, one. Put you right there. One. And do we have engineers on these guys yet? We do not. So grab engineering. Central American engineer dude. And we're already losing again. All right, that's fine. All right. Is there anyone else that we could really take out? Oh, Kafa. We did want to get Kafa, so. Ooh. How long do we have a war go until 94? It's not bad. Ooh, that's better. Naval Navy's build time. We should probably start trying to get some battleships, too, but there's so much we got to do. Hey, we're six in the world now. Let's see. We've a lot of suppression points. Let's, put, let's suppress some people, because suppression is nice sometimes. But we could do this, too. Oh, we get... Basically, when we remove the Jiza thing, we get 10% less tax efficiency, but we get 25% more assimilation rate. Ooh, does not belong to the dominant religion. This could be very bad. Hmm. I think I've already read this, so. I think we've got enough time. Let's go and do that. There you go. Wow, that hurts. That really hurts. Uh, let's see. Infamy. Minus point one. Not great. Secularized society. We do not have a theocracy. And to do this one, it would be an our spirit influence. I thought you guys already were. Oh, maybe is it the Bahrain? No, it's you guys. Wait, which group was that? Where to do? The Trucial Treaty. UAE is at peace. Is in the sphere of influence. Oh, we just need greater relations. That's fine. That's fine then. Yeah, if I go to war with anyone else besides Kaffa, I'm sure we're going to get bushwhacked. But what if we made a pit stop in Greece? We could actually have European land. Now, is anyone trying to sphere Greece? Maybe. That's a big problem. That's a big old maybe. They're not strong at all. Well, they have a little bit of strength, but not that much strength. The Dutch are doing pretty darn well for themselves. Do we go to war with Korea? No, they're in a the sphere of those guys. Yeah, we're running out of people to kill off. I mean, I mean uh, <clears throat> put under a new administration. Because if you look at the spheres, America and the UK got all their hands gobbledygooked in all of the Americas, which kind of sucks. But Peru, maybe. Dominican Republic? Hey, you're kind of independent. Hey, I like your independence. Cool. Please don't get found out. Please. But anyways, out the comments. Let's see. Fishers in... What was this? Cabinda is high. Unemployment is... And many have been turning to sea to eke out a living. Local officials are suggesting that the Tukular empires or Tukular support... We should support them. Fish. What do they have there? Cabinda. Well, there's all the... Oh, it's all in Africa here, of course. And they are... Ooh. I don't know. Tropical wood sells for 1.38. That's not a lot, but when you look at fish, raw material, uh, the price is dropping for tropical wood. Where is fish? Consumer goods? Are, are fish consumer goods? Mm, I'm not seeing fish. I'm, maybe I'm blind. It's definitely not. Uh, oh, there they are. Yeah, no. Courage of fisheries? No. It's too valuable. Good luck, guys. Uh, you need coal? That's fine. We'll do that, too. It's fine. Whatever. Blue water navies? Awesome. Other comments included. Get military science. Investment banks. Do a mega campaign as Poland. And obviously, I'll see you in just a little bit, but I want to get through the comments before we do anything else. Ooh, that's good. But, let's see. Do a campaign as Poland. I do want to play as Poland eventually in Victoria to lower poverty. And yeah, Switch ideology to socialist, maybe, maybe not. We'll see what happens, but I'll see you guys in just a little bit. All right, everyone, welcome back to our little campaign here. So, we're now eighth in the world in industrial power, sixth in the world for military score, and actually, our military score, uh, our navy barely makes up our score. <laughs> 1.776. Hey, 1776, don't mind if I do, America. Anyways, we're fourth in the world for prestige. Our guys are doing pretty okay here. Do we have any more projects? Weapons? I don't have that much money, but sure, we're, we just ran out of money. Okay, but we're going to need more money, so we're going to do this, unfortunately. I've already lowered tariffs down to pretty much absolutely nothing. But unfortunately, the government needs a little bit more money right now, so thank you very much. Artificial cement. It's only 1892, and we figured out how to build a cement factory. Ah, very good. 
I kind of don't want to keep doing this just because it's getting a little crazy here. But hey, maybe we'll keep doing it. Oh, wait, we lost this. Oh, is this between these two? Not even Spain? I guess me and Spain lost it here. Well, yeah, whatever it is what it is. I can't complain too much about that. We're trying to get some early railroads. We did finish up business banks, so we got a little bit more money, which is kind of nice, actually. I could really use more money. Mo money, mo beta. 486. I mean, that's not bad. Uh, if we lose in a great war, our, the campaign is over. I'll just be honest with you guys, just because there's so many different cultures and, like, regions here and people that we pretty much explode. Also, we have all this now, and we even slither down into here, too, which is kind of disgusting, but hey, whatever. Shiwa, Lonwa, that's fine with me, you know. Uh, let's see, cool. Actually, at this point, we cannot cross over to there, so anything we set up here uh, has to come to the rally point over here. So, actually, we can make this army a little bit better. So, we have 3-3. Three, three. We need 2-2. Two, two. At least that's how I think it's going to work. So, let's grab 1, 2, Uno, huzzah. And, of course, Portugal is our ally, so, yeah, we don't even have access to it there. That kind of sucks. God, this always looks so weird on the maps. German Namibia is cool and all, but, like, this? They're, t they're touching tips right here, but it just always looks so weird with the jutting out, or juting out. And we have our war justification done for Santo Domingo, and we're just waiting for a boat to get over there, I think. Where's the boat? Oh, they're not, they're not feeling really good. Maybe I should stop using Clipper Transports. Just saying, just because they're, they're a little outdated at this point. Maybe. I should really focus a little bit more on my Navy. I Actually building ships. That are, well, usable, probably, we'll say. Good, we got more money. We're going to keep building up more and more of our uh, naval bases. That'll be good. Give them uh, one month. There you go. That's good enough. Good enough. Uh, railroad transportation groups. That's nice. Communist rebel organization gained behind it, though. Dogma of mass action. Well, good luck with that. Uh, I'm not really sure what, what else I can tell you about that, but good luck. Ooh, another naval base. Sure. And for forget. National focuses. Don't want to forget about these guys. Not too bad. We did finish another one over here. Uh, we got the state done here. That's kind of nice. Well, at least one of these states. I think. Maybe not. Was it down here? Oh, it's down here, down here that we got it done. Yeah, it's not bad. Anywhere else? Oh, we got to keep increasing relations with these guys, too. Well, that'll be bueno. The Eritrean Christian. The latest great power conference that set rules for the division of Africa is the word of the owner of the Assad, the whole region of Eritrea. We hold lands there and thus have two choices. We can defy the will of the conference, the risking war, we can cooperate with the other great powers. I really don't want to go to war with the UK. They kind of like us. They're one in everything. Come and take it. <sighs> Basically, we're going to lose this, which cuts off all of our land here, which is dumb. Which is super dumb. Hmm. Why was it said to them? Why? The great powers for the division of Africa. Why was I not consulted about this? I didn't even get a vote for Sweden taking over the Congo, I think. Hmm. I mean, they try to fight us. You know what? I don't think I can really do anything about that. I, I don't want to lose infamy, but at this point, I, I will kill off, hopefully by the end of this campaign, the UK. That pisses me off. Well, it doesn't really piss me off. It just it makes it frustrating. We were doing so well over here. And they, they just take it. I mean, I love getting less infamy. Don't get me wrong. But that's such garbage. And now you guys are trapped? Oh, UK, you've, you've made an enemy out of someone that you don't want to make an enemy out of. And that's the Africans. Iron railroads are good. Organic chemistry. High pressure steam stuff. I should probably really try to do better here. Because this will help us with our score, too. So... I should really do better here as well. Machine guns. Yeah, machine guns. That's that's pretty good to get. Delegated power. Inventions are pretty darn good as well. Yeah. Let's go with that one next. Cool. Alright, the ships have made it. Cool. I really want my ships actually to do a little better now. Get a little bit more strength on you guys. That would be good. Hopefully no one else goes to war with us. Because if that, they do, that would be not very good for us. La Vega. Actually, you go all the way to Santo Domingo. See if they have any soldiers there. Please don't get involved. For the love of God, please, 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 please. Can we do this quickly? Hey, they're gone. They haven't colonized. Our uh, products we range, let's conserve support. Everything else happens. Oh, we also get another reform as well. I didn't show you guys yet. But now we have transportation of the penal system. Cool. I am considering withdrawing because I, I don't want to fight the Germans. Uh, if any anyone, I do not want to fight the Germans there at all. I really don't want to fight Germans. How much longer do we have for this, though? Great powers are at war. 
It's still going up slowly, but... Actually, who else is it? Well, I'm at war, but, you know, what else is new? Happy 1893, everyone. Hope you're having a great, great year. But I think we can continue beating up uh, Colombia if we really want to. Up, seek it down. Incident in Uruguay. I don't know if it's in, call it, what we would call an incident. Gosh darn Dutch peoples. Yep, another month, another month went by. At least we lowered our infamy after getting five more infamy, which really does suck. Well, that's all right. There you go. There we go. Not bad. La Vega. And now, actually, since you're the rally point for that group, I'm gonna put you guys over here, back in Colombia. Get some over there. And what are you guys using? Cavalry and infantry. So let's do this again. Recruitment. They have one cavalry, one infantry. Let's grab an engineer immediately. And then one of these, and then another one of those, which gives us another thing to get another piece of artillery. Very good. Actually, we'll do the same thing up here, too. You guys are two and two, so we need a cavalry division, then. And actually, we're going to build up a hussar, because they have better recon than normal cavalry. Hey, look at this. Alright, incarceration. Oh, we could do that rehabilitation. I like that assimilation, so let's go incarceration. Oh, we can build a state in Niger. Nice. A free state of all things. Man, I'll probably have to pull out of that. That sucks. Ooh, and... I mean, if we have to go to war with the Germans eventually... I mean, we probably will, honestly. But I don't want to do it now. We're not ready yet. You know what? Pull out. I hate doing that so much. But I'm coming for the Dutch. I'm coming for the, the English or the British. Maybe the Germans. They are allied to us, so... But now we're peace. That's good. Ooh, actually, I'll help them build up railroads because it's a lot cheaper for them for us to help them out build railroads compared to everything else. I don't do that. That's fine. Whatever. And now we need more money. Let's go and slash the budget. I'm not really sure who else we can attack for now. Go and lower that all the way there. All the way there as well. Gold Rush. Hey! And hey -ya. Where's hey -ya? Oh, gold. Nice. More life rating? Where's Ahia? Oh, oh is over here! Oh, look at that, nice. We have Islamic fundamentalists over here, but hey, Gold Rush is nice. Anybody want to come over here? Sudanese people, Baodin. Oh, we love the Baodins. The primary accepted cultures, that's good. Come over here and increase relations once again. Oh, well, I guess we do that too. It's fine, but whatever. Nice. So, Kafa. I only have one army over here, but they only have one army too, so. And that is. Oh, not that much ahead of time. I really don't know who else we can take out at this point. I think it might just be best to consolidate, build, grow, get better, achieve, do more things here. So, and you know what? You're not even a state yet. You guys are. I'm going to build... Can we build roads there? Should we build roads in our capital, maybe? We can't build roads in our capital. Okay, that sucks. It's fine. Even though we can wait for capitals to build roads here. I'm just going to go ahead and do it. It doesn't matter to me too much. I should probably use a railroad uh, map modifier for this, but whatever. Nice. 34.9.5. Um, we could try to maybe find someone in Central America, maybe? Is it like Los Altos or something? We got a lot of colonial score, though. Like, down here. Colonial power, I should say. Guatemala. Colombia and Peru. But they're allied with those guys over there. Oh, what happened to... Hey, a reactionary presidential, presidential dictatorship, you say? Civilized nation. Hmm. Hmm. We can make them a puppet. Making them a puppet would not be bad. They'd pretty much be under the rest of the campaign, too, if we did that. We could acquire a state, but that looked pretty ugly. But maybe if I, maybe I want a state. Actually, what are the RGOs around here like? Eh. Not great. I mean, our military isn't superb. I'm thinking maybe we get them as a puppet. That might be pretty good to get. I can't imagine them doing becoming a great power under us. So why not? 
I'm going to keep Terra Cypher on because I want a lot of money. I want to build a lot of things. Rubber found. Hey! Where's that one? Okay, yeah, this is a great state down here. Very nice. Very, very nice. Look at all that money we're raking in. Nice. And we got through another month, which is awesome. Very good. So you guys are doing okay. I guess we built some roads here. That's fine. Whatever. Yeah, definitely not there. Definitely not in the mountains. Ooh, a new base. Yes, what do we do? Um... Wow, look at that. 10%. Whoa! 63% Fulba. Whoa! Nice. Any assimilation? Not really. Any religious assimilation? No, that well, kind of sucks, but whatever. Army decision making is almost done too. A mountain of coal. Ooh! Oh, it's right there. There's coal right there. Nice. Do we already have a coal factory? Because we have one thing right here, but even more coal? Not bad. And we almost have dis army decision making skills. Chartist rallies. Uh, Chartist club calling for the extension of voting privileges to broader strata of the voting publicum. While relatively calm and orderly on the surface, the rally might get out of hand at any time. Police are standing by, ready to intervene, and some among them even seem e even eager to go. Let them hold their little. What the hell? Eh, that's fine. They can hold a little rally. That's fine. And you know what? Just in case, I'm going to go and save the game. Look at all my, uh, saves. Whee! That's a lot of saves. <laughs> cool. And so we got that. Some more stuff here done, which is great and all. I think it's best to focus on industry and just, like, building ourselves up. So then again, we got to get some ships. I do want investment banks. I want more. I just want more industry right now. Pit coals, more coal production would be nice. Coal, coal, coal. Roads would not be bad. Organic chemistry. High pressure steam is okay. It's all right. We could use more stuff. But army stuff. Commerce. Uh, we'll get it all done eventually. Just go and get get organic chemistry. There we go. We'll try that one. Try that one out for size. Ooh, what's happening? Ooh, okay, bye-bye. Looking a little better here. Okay, some of these ships are not looking good. Spend as much as you want on the Navy for now. That's fine. We got plenty of money. All right, let's 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 do what we need to do. Projects invest. Factories. We lost all our money already. All right. <laughs> all it takes is like two seconds for us to lose all of our money. That's all. That's all. And we're still trying to sphere these guys too, but we'll see what happens. Don't forget about this. Incident Antigua. Just. Just casual terrorism down there. That's just that's all this. Just casual terrorism. Who are we gonna go to war with? Argen oh yeah. Ooh, maybe Argentina. Hmm. If that's the case. Uh, we're gonna keep terrorists high. Yeah, we're gonna keep everything pretty high right now. Let's get ready to go though. Uh, we need better ships there. I gotta move some navies, or some armies around too. You guys are going over there, which is good. You guys are over there as well. Oh, our ship he's doing because we're gonna need a few armies for this. Oh, not too bad. Get on the boat, guys. Head on over to Uruguay. They have 36 score, so you better be careful about that. Consciousness in colonial social psychology, alright. How's this looking? Not bad, not bad. Oh, railroads, don't mind if we do. Recruitment, colonial. Hey, we're almost done here. We're done there too, nice. Administrative. There you go. And they are foldable, so that's pretty good for us, actually. Nice. Head on over. Get some more morale and such. Alright, so let's go and make another army here. Let's see. Actually, let's just do it like this then. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. One. Boom. Independent command. More organization. Great. Okay, we didn't even need to save scum. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And we go to war by November 6th, 1894. And the Ottomans are doing better down here, too. Everyone else is pretty much at peace for now. It's kind of unusual, but whatever. See, as long as we're attacking the middle class, taxing them, the lower class. And, ooh, more. There we go. Finally got germ theory. That's good. More trinket healthcare, probably, eventually. 
Uh, it's just gonna take some time to get some more stuff done. That's all. Bum, bum. We have still three armies here to put down any resistance, and still armies better. Okay, France and Germany's got to kill each other off later on. Oh, come on. Spain got that for free. Spain. Oh, let's do this one too, since we're still at peace for now. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. We're at peace. Wait, do we have a decision? Crucial treaty? Yeah, we have this one. Oh, we need mass politics. Okay. Oh, wait, here we go. How, how, how we can do this? Cost between two to six million pounds. Oh, my goodness. We need machine tools, drilling and blasting, and screw propelled steamers. We definitely need that. So, at this point, we'll get Balboa as a core. That's actually pretty nice. And that's right here. Wait, Western Nigritic. Um, hmm. Is that? Is that from us? So, let's take a look at this. Look at the map. Wow, America's getting a lot of immigrants. <laughs> no one wants to go to British North America, though. Well, they do want to go to Canada, but whatever. Oh, not bad. Ooh. Yeah, no one... There's very few people leaving us. But within our own... Wow, look at... Look at all this. I mean, it looks really bad, but actually not that many guys. Well, as far as we can tell. Please push and leave and go to other places. That's so cool that you can see that... Oh, they're, oh, they're, they're leaving our country! What the heck? No, 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 you don't leave our country. No, 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 no. You're not allowed to leave our country. No, 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 no. Get back here. <laughs> uh, I guess these guys... They have a few rebels. I want at least three armies. We're probably going to need four, maybe? I don't want to just take any more soldiers from here. I don't want to take another army from here, though. Because this is, this is our heartland, basically. So. Have we made it? Yes, we... Sort of have? Yeah. Alright, let's see what happens. If we go to war, then I'll, then you'll see me do some crazy stuff off-screen. Or on-screen, or whatever. I still want these guys under us. To go to Empire. We're so close connecting. Well, not really. <sighs> America, why did you get metal and other stuff? Oh, so the Dutch are with the Germans. We have the Portuguese, and the Spanish have the, are under the Germans. Switzerland's under the French, Belgium. The UK has Sweden for some reason. Uh, even the Italians are feared by the Germans, sort of. Interesting. Interesting how these, these things are working out. The Qing Empire, well, it's kind of by itself. Whatever. Ooh, before we do anything else, you can get some more railroads. I know I did say I want to save some money, but sometimes you just got to build more roads so you can get more money. It's, if it's blue, it can be given more roads, if I remember correctly. Nice. And I will spend the money for this, because this will help out later on. There you go. And we're pretty much out of money now. Glorious. It's always good to use up all your money before you go to war. Alright, got one more month. There we go. Let's go ahead and go to war and see what happens. We should do okay. That's really disgusting. I gave Bolivia that. Really disgusting. Alright. Who will not accept? The German Empire will not accept. That's fine. So instead, we're going to call in our allies. Who do we have as allies? Bolivia. <laughs> oh, that, wow, they're hostile to the French, the British. They're hostile to everyone except us. Holy crap. It's fine with me. That's fine with me, man. Uh, who else are we going to call in? Our other allies. We're going to call in the very powerful UAE. Ooh, not the Germans. I can't remember who we're allied with. Who in the world are we allied with? Friendly... Oh, Persia and Portugal. They're not even my... Puppet, but whatever. Nothing like... Calling in the Persians help in a war against Argentinians. There you go. Colon. Come just go straight to Buenos Aires. See what we can do about that. Um, I don't really want to try them. Look, like they got five caps. Uh, they might be really outdated. You know what? We can risk it. 5v5. Oh, they left. Where'd they go? Why'd you leave? More A martyr. Just imprison the dude. It's fine. Whatever. Membership of the International Olympic Committee. So, the combination of renewed interest in ancient Greek civilization and the idea of sport as an important part of social development has led a French art aristocrat, Baron Pierre de Combartin. To propose reviving the Olympic Games as a way to promote international peace through friendly athletic competition between nations. Should our nation join his International Olympic Committee to organize the first games? Pay or owe 50,000 bucks. Yeah. It's fine. 
Oh. Oh, wow. That's a lot of dudes. Uh, Parana? If that's the case, you guys can come down here immediately. Oh boy. Oh boy. Now they've already lost 900. We lost 437 right there. Oh boy. Now they have minus one for crossing. We have no dice roll, but we have a good defense. We are really good on defense. Oh my goodness. Oh, we're throwing more guys in. Now that was nice. The workhouse scandal. I, I'd say they fed the pigs better than they ever did us. A local scandal coming out of one of our states has garnered a fair amount of national attention during the last few weeks. Apparently, a foreman at one of the local workhouses has embezzled public funds a lot of him and recovered the losses by serving poor quality food, sometimes not more than a few slices of their bread each day, to the people employed by this institution. The case has become a soapbox for conservatives and liberals alike, with conservatives arguing against government intervention and liberals arguing for the need for more social reforms. Back local conservatives. Back the liberals. Uh, we're going to piss people off. I'm going to go with conservative just because over time we're going to get even more so, like social support. So, eventually we're going to lose conservative support. So, we'll do them for now. And you know what? They attacked us. Keep following them. Come straight to Buenos Aires. You should do okay there. There we go. No, go over there. We're losing already. Okay, so we won. We lost way too many guys. So, at this point, it's time for us to stop attacking like crazy and do what we must. I'm gonna have one of you guys go over there. Now we gotta keep all our guys around together. A little bit more closely. God dang it, come on. Alright, spread yourselves out. But be close enough that we can help each other out if we need to. Alright, if they wanna really attack again. Yep, okay. Well, that's a bit extreme, I'd say. Hey, Portugal, thanks for showing up. Oh, yeah. Yep. Gotta remember, especially late... We're, pr we're approaching late game at this point. Don't don't begin attacking. You gotta defend. Bait the enemy to coming into your lands. They lost 2,700. We lost r less than 400 in that one day. Redonkulous. I just want you under us. And... Oh, there we go. Low health cover. Yes. Yes. Oh, they even threw more guys in. It's such a meat grinder when you do it like this. Now, I'm not going to attack them. We're going to go straight for the capital, though. Directive on the Grand on trade in the provinces? As part of our government's citizenship policy, soldiers of the Home Army have been ordered only by goods from the Fulba traders. This is starting to aggravate already existing tensions in Bela. A local Western Nigritic traders feel the effects of the government discrimination. The policy stands. There's in the policy. Government stands. Discrimination. Yay. Hey, more max speed. Nice. Hey, more population growth. We love it. So how much score do we need to actually make them our puppet? 15. We don't have that much. Don't worry about that for now. Keep these guys close by. Because they're going to go to Cologne next. I want to see them attack Cologne. Uh, when will they get there? 14th? We'll get there on the 11th. I'm putting you guys up here then. Better supply limit's not bad. Head on in. And we're going to immediately grab another one for army. We're going to go ahead and grab more morale and military tactics. Nice. Oh, that's so good. Nice. Got 2.7 more score. Now they're coming to Parana. I don't want to do that because that's going to actually really hurt us. Hey. Carbon soil enri enrichment. Not bad. We're back down to 7th in the world for score. Whatever. Hey, we've got Buenos Aires. Nice. Rosario. Very good, very good. You have to really micro your wards to do well here, which is totally fine with me. Anything else for roads, maybe? I want to make sure that we're okay on roads. Actually, let's see about this. No, it's not a road, but whatever. We'll still support them. And we're out of money again. I gotta save money. Yeah, I keep spending money on stuff. Uh, you'll be there on the 12th. You'll be there on the 11th, which is fine. Actually, I should have just let them in, but whatever. If we can conquer, like, three places well, compared to them... Ooh, Dongola, whatever. We've seen that plenty of times before. Cool. They get one province back. I take out several provinces. Not a bad idea. Oh, that's a really unbalanced. We should really fix this. They got more armies coming around. 
Nice. Come on down here. Oh, look at that. We killed a ship. Not bad. Oh, the Persians. Even the, even the Persians arrived. Nice. Oh, they got some guys up there, too. Well, keep an eye on that. Uh, Bolivia. Make sure we got good relations with you. I think I built up a factory with for them, too. So, they, they don't even have a million people there yet. Let's see where these guys end up. Can you get there in time? 18th? Ooh, that's that's pretty... I don't want to risk that. We'll go back to the capital soon enough. Thirtieth. Oh, we can probably kill those 3,000 off. That shouldn't be too bad. There we go. Not bad. 3,000 will get decimated by us, which is a good thing. Come back to Buenos Aires. Come there, right there. Beautiful. I'm guessing technically you could use a fourth army for this bloody strike if you like it about this one. Ooh, more arduo throughput. Throughput. More socials. I don't want more socials for now. That's fine. Don't want to forget this either. Not bad. 80% already there. Hey, we're down there too. I think at this point I want to start investing like some more points into places like this. That probably be, would be good. One, two, three. Bing, bong, bing. Army risk management, not bad. We do need to get mass politics, but we gotta wait. There we go. Uh oh. Uh oh. The Caroline Islands. Where's that? There's a crisis. I hope you guys are here. Oh boy. The UK versus Germany. Reforms. Bahrain fears out of might. Did you know that? Oh, baby. We'll see what happens with that. To do this, going to spend at least forty percent. We need invested gas lights. Let's get rehabilitation. We lose suppression points, but we get more assimilation rate, and I, I like that. And then maybe we'll give them a low minimum wage. Maybe. Maybe. We might be able to kill these guys off. They have no artillery, no horses. So, oh, maybe that was a bad idea. That was probably a bad idea. Well, maybe that was an okay idea, actually. Nice. Go ahead and out right there. Well, we got all these places. Where are you going to go? Oh, we can sphere. Honduras, again? Just, oh, I'm justify war. Wait, what, what, what can we do with them? Remove nations. Oh, okay. There we go, nice. Oh crap. Oh, I just, I'm glad I looked over here. Oh boy, that's not good. Woo! Alright, get back up there. Oh yeah, they're gonna be dying very quickly. They'll get there on the 19th, we'll get there on the 21st. Ooh, there's definitely a great war happening. Oh, what happened? Boy, why do we have unemployed people? We don't have that much money to spare for you guys, but what the heck? We have no clerks, too. We should probably fix that, too. Oh, Hispaniola. Oh, there you go. Nice. Alright, so can we piece these guys out yet? No. Oh, cut Argentina down in size. No, I think we're okay for now. On the 19th, that's in two days. That's fine. You get one of those guys going that way. That's fine. Um, they have no morale, so this actually should be okay to do then. Okay, we just killed them all off. I'm feeling pretty good about that, not gonna lie. 487. I really want to see what's going to happen for this crisis. Oh, Germany's by themselves. Oh, bully Germany. Bully Germany. Not us. You just bully everyone else, not me. Uh, you guys could probably actually go home. I can continue blockading them. Good. Uh, don't go that way. Go over there. Actually, come down here then. Wow, our money just went down the pooper. What happened? Do we have embargoes or something? Total expenses. Quite a bit. National stockpile. Uh, wait, we have 
Why do I keep getting debt to Germany? Eh, eh, probably for daily expenses. Oh, that's probably good. Hmm. We should probably try to get out of this war as fast as possible. Hey, Empire Brazil. And the Empire Brazil starts with a T, so we go there. Nice. Very good. Uh, you guys go there. That'd be fine. Come on, Argentina. Give it up. You know you can't win. And I know I can't afford all this budget stuff. Wow, that's a lot of money. Uh, I don't want to do this, but we're going to have to for now. It's unfortunate, guys. I know. As soon as we're done with this war, we'll lower the taxes. Nice. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. That's all. See, that's all we wanted. That's all we wanted. Repay their loan. Whee! Uh, keep it down there. That doesn't matter. Keep it down to there. That's good. Lower that as much as possible. And now we're going to be raking up a lot of money. I'm going to keep it at around 50% tariffs. But, hey, look at this. Great estate down here, too. Awesome. I appreciate it. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. We're out of money, but we got another puppet under us. Took a little Argentina and Bolivia are now with us. But regardless, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below. Tomorrow's episode, we'll probably go back to war with Colombia if we can, take him out, but really focus on building ourselves up more. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.